Hi, this is Slosh. Buzz. And welcome back to Beer O'Clock with Slosh and Buzz. It's been, what, three months? It's been a while, but what we happened? are back after the winter. What happened? Did we take the winter off or did I we just get, just get busy? Things happen during the winter. It was a winter of, of things happening. It was a winter of our discontent. <laughs> it was. There were was, um, there was some things, things happening. I can't even remember. Anyway, <laughs> um, we're back with another run. And as always, there is a theme. Um, but we are starting with Viking, which is made in Iceland. It's a Pilsner. Viking Pilsner. Don't put this stuff on my chair. Um, a Viking Pilsner imported by Seven Continents, um, brewed and bottled in Acre... Acre... No. Rary? Acre... Contrary. Iceland by Vil... Phil Fiffle. Phil Fiffle? Acre... Yeah. yeah. Phil Fiffle? Phil Fiffel. Phil Fiffel. Phil Fiffel. Phil Fiffel. Phil Fiffel. It Phil is a... Uh, <laughs> It is, <laughs> it is a 4.4% <laughs> alcohol pilsner made in Iceland. Mm. So let's get back into it. We're way out of uh, practice. I can't even I remember. It's made with glacier water. Wouldn't that be nice? Um, I think it does say that actually. Yeah? I actually think it does on the front. At the top. From the pure, From the pure water. waters of Iceland. Yeah. Iceland water. Mm. Well, they've got toilets in Iceland, so. Not like India? No. Mm. No, it's called. Never mind. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Viking, eh? It's really light. Mm, that is dry. It's as almost well. very dry. Almost no aftertaste whatsoever. Mm. Actually, you know what? That's kind of reminding me of those Asian beers we had. Yeah, those ones that you drink and then they just literally just vanish, disappear. I could drink a lot of it on a hot day though, without even noticing. And then, yeah, you'd need it to be served really cold as well. Mm. Well, I guess in Iceland it'd be hard to get it warm. Yeah. It'd yeah. be difficult, like you'd have That's to put right. effort into making it warm. Yeah. If your beer goes warm in Iceland, you fail it. You're doing beer. something wrong. Unless you're in a sauna. Do they do saunas Unless in you're Iceland? Drinking, well, yeah. You, some beers are meant to be drunk warm. In a sauna. Sure. Um, <laughs> look, I like Vikings. I'm going to give it eight on presentation. It's pale, it's light, there's not too much of a real flavour to it. I'm going to give it five on, on flavour. Um, nothing wrong with it, but nothing special. Is yeah, how I nothing feel about wrong it. with it, but nothing great about it. Mm. Yeah. I do like the bottle. It's just Vikings. It's quite clear in the glass, the look of it. Look at that, look at him. Look at him, look at how many animals he's got. It's pretty metal, yeah. yeah. Got, Vikings I'll give it a seven on presentation. Did Vikings use spears? I think they would Pikes? Pikes. I thought they would yeah. use things bigger. But anyway. And um, I'll probably give it a four on flavour as well. It's, yeah, quite dry. Um, not much, no. It's, it's, it's almost yeah, non-existent. Terms. Yeah, it's... Almost it's, non-existent. It's almost like one of those Asian beers. So, yeah, so we, we, we do not speak of that one. Seven. <laughs> Um, as always, guys, there is a theme that's <laughs> running through it. So the first person who gets the theme yep. wins a bottle of chili sauce. We're a little bit out of practice, but we'll be back for number yeah, two next we'll week. So, Good uh, to see you again, though. Yes, Thanks for back. tuning in. Uh, as always, thank you very much for watching, and we will see you next Sunday. All right. Summer. Catch ya. Booze. Face.